hi guys welcome to my channel how you all doing hope good my name is marlene tingo and if this is your first time here you're welcome to my OG, thanks for coming again by the way i'm a Cameroonian based in ghana and on today's video i will share with you guys 10 things i like about ghana so if that's the kind of content you like to see keep watching <laughs> Obviously, the points I'll be naming to you guys are the experiences I've had in the last one year staying in Ghana. So the very first thing I'll talk about is stable electricity. Um, unlike other African countries, for example, Cameroon and Nigeria, I feel like the electricity situation in Ghana is far better. It's more stable, even though it's not hundred percent, but at least it's far better than what I have from even where I'm coming from. I could go for months without having lights out. I mean, that's a privilege that I can't even in my own country but also they have a good prepaid system once you've used all that you've bought that's for the electricity you can always go back and refill and use it and use until it gets finished so i really love that about ghana the second thing i like about ghana is that the security i love how secure ghana is i would say ghana is one of the safest african countries to be in or to live in having lived here for one year i'll say this for free Ghana is safe. The security here yeah, is top notch. I mean, like there, though. I mean, like there've been times that I slept unconsciously without locking my door. Please, if you know my house, I lock my door these days. I lock it. Yeah, it was before, and I'm just saying this because I've experienced like really weird situations in my country, Cameroon. And I will say this: Ghana is very safe. Even at times that you go out, I rarely go out. And come back like really late well on a few occasions that i've come back late i would say that even driving through the streets is safe i mean like it's not that bad <laughs> you hardly hear of crazy things happening around maybe just for some few occasions like i heard something that happened in ashima that they killed a policeman but those are just one of the rare cases to tell the truth ghana is very safe and i love the security in ghana the third thing i like about ghana is the accessible online transport system like it just works perfectly for me and i believe for every other foreigner in this country because even when you come here that you don't know a lot of places trust me you can go about your way without physical assistance because you have you have most of those online transport systems like both you can just stay at the comfort of your hotel or your house and then you order a car once you just put the location there it takes you to the exact location i mean how good can it be i hear there's yango right now in cameroon but it's but it's not in all the regions but anyways i really like that for ghana and it just makes life so easy and also with the fact that you don't have to negotiate the prices with the drivers because it can be so crazy especially when the drivers know you're a foreigner they might end up charging you more the fourth thing i like about ghana is it has beautiful touristic sites i think that's why a lot of foreigners move into ghana a lot of current foreigners visit ghana because trust me it has like very beautiful touristic sites from all these places i've been to and many other i'm yet to go there so stick to this channel because we'll be visiting more places over here <laughs> yeah but ghana has like very beautiful touristic sites i'm going to slide some pictures places have been to so far did you see that trust me there's much more here and we would definitely be exploring that i just love how beautiful a lot of these places are and i can't wait to visit more beautiful places over here in ghana which takes me to the fifth point i love the food <laughs> i know they don't have a lot of varieties but a few that i've tried are really so delicious i've tried wache i've tried a banku and okra stew i've tried fufu and palm nut soup and trust me and the jollof rice the ghana jollof all these meals are so delicious these are my favorites so far and the only ones i've tried anyways we are taking it slowly <laughs> that reminds me i really need to do a mukbang on this channel with one of your meals this is ghana and you can only get the authentic ghana ghanian meals over here trust me you will love it that's one of the things i like about ghana moving to the next the sixth thing i love about ghana is their cultural outfits oh i so much love their traditional outfits the ones they wear during their weddings the other ones they wear during the festivals love their cultural looks i'm going to put some slides
<laughs> but anyways i love their cultural looks i love the kente fabric there's no way i'm going to leave ghana without designing a beautiful kente dress for myself i really love the fact that it's woven like the symbols the colors ah i love it i love their traditional outfit so maybe in the course of editing this video i might add some pictures just so non ghanians foreigners will understand i mean like they really have beautiful cultural outfits and that's one of the things i love about ghana moving to the next i love the fact that they promote their language oh my god i said it in one of their videos that they speak a lot of their languages i think i think some people did not understand me they actually came for me and i deleted a comment so even if you go under that video you know find it because i don't like negative vibes so i actually deleted some of the comments because why would you drop that under my video <laughs> But anyways, they speak a lot of their language, they promote it. Like even from the airport, the Aquaba they tell you that means welcome. Hello. I've learned a couple of words in three. It is a <laughs> if you're from Ghana, please answer down below. You understand? <laughs> <laughs> yeah they promote a lot of their languages and i like that because you find someone that speaks ga as their language that same person can speak three and vice versa i mean you find little children that can speak three they can speak ga i even speak away i mean that's just so nice and i love that and speaking of promoting their language most of their musicians sing in three or ga and all of that just to promote it and you find that foreigners are singing in the languages even without understanding the meaning of the songs even like joe meter i sing some of his songs and i have to ask my friends the meaning of the lyrics either ways i'm learning the language and i love that they are really proud of their language i hope you guys can see that i wasn't coming from a negative perspective when i said a lot of ghanians love speaking their native language the thing i love about ghana and i don't know why it's coming towards the end of this video anyways ghanians are very honest respectful people like i can say this for free i'm telling you this like i'm telling you this for free ghanians are very honest people very respectful people and they are so friendly like in many ways i have experienced it like i'm saying this not from that i heard from people like i've experienced it ghanians are so friendly they are so honest to work with I just feel they are loyal and so far i really trust and i love working with ghanians and uh, i would say this ghanians are very honest respectful and friendly people and they make life so easy for a lot of foreigners like us this point is more related to my field i would say this they are really good fashion schools in ghana and i like that because even before applying to my school in ghana there were a lot of other fashion schools that i saw i mean that's really so nice for the nation and also most of the fashion students studying in ghana here from cameroon or nigeria will tell you that ghana has a lot they have a variety of haberdashery items here a lot of these items that you won't find in these other countries here over here in ghana and there's a lot of uh, sewing accessory stores like even in cameroon the little i knew about tailoring that's not like i learned to like just going to give my clothes to my seamstress to sew me something maybe she asked me to buy so so and so stuff like i really did not see a variety of the things that i see over here in ghana they have lovely fabrics over here ghana is one of the best countries i'll tell you you can study fashion and designing in and the last point there's hardly that kind of crazy traffic over here in accra probably because probably because the population is not that much but also it's an advantage and also that's why i like ghana you hardly have that kind of crazy traffic maybe on specific days like friday evenings because of funerals and all of that and it's not really that serious so those are the 10 amazing things i love about ghana are you a foreigner in ghana let me know in the comment sections and also if there there's anything i haven't mentioned that you like about ghana let me know in the comment section as well if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and join this family and i'll see you in my next one bye